Um, so again, the first thing I'd like to do for this problem is plot the points. So I go 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4. My directrix is at y equals 7. That's a y value at 7. So if it were 4, 5, 6, 7. Now, the main important thing, Dylan, when you're going through this problem is understanding, again, like the last example, my parabola cannot open up because my directrix is above. If you guys remember all those two graphs, the directrix is in the opposite direction of the focus. So my graph is going to be opening down. I don't know what the graph looks like, but I'm just going to sketch the parabola. So I know it's going to be opening down. Now, the main important thing is I want to find my focus. I need to find the value of p. Remember, the distance between the vertex and the directrix is equal to, equal to the distance of the vertex to the focus. So I find my value of p, which is 1, 2, 3. So therefore, I just need to go down another 3, 1, 2, 3, to find my focus. Um, you could also take your vertex, and basically what you guys can see is to go from here, I am like subtracting 3 to go to my focus. All right, So I'm going down to go to my focus, rather than the last example, I had to go up from the vertex. So let's see, we have vertex, in this case, is 3, 4. To find my focus, my focus is basically my vertex minus 3. So that's going to be 3, 1. Or you can also see from this graph, it's pretty simple, right? Uh, the next thing is the axis symmetry. Axis symmetry is going to be, again, a vertical line at the x coordinate of the vertex, which is 3. And the directrix is, we already are given the directrix. And then you guys can obviously see the graph opens down. Now to write the equation of the line, now we actually have some points for h and k, right? That's my h, that's my k. Does everybody agree? Whereas now, knowing this, we know p is equal to negative 3. And that's kind of the important thing for you guys to understand. p, in reality, p, I should have explained this a little bit clearer, p is actually the distance. The actual value p is the distance from the vertex, from the vertex to the focus while as that same distance is equal back to the directrix. But p, in this case, is going to be negative 3. So when I go and plug in my points, I have x minus 3. Since the graph opens down, I know x is going to be squared. So I have x minus 3 squared equals negative 12 times y minus 4. Now, based on our understanding, yes? No, it's still x minus h, x minus k. So it would be x minus 3, x minus 4. Oh, this is just for the vertex. Okay. Yeah, like so your equation is going to be x minus 3 squared equals negative 12 times y minus 4. Does everybody see why um, I want to be a little bit more clear with you? The reason why, do you guys notice, again, for a graph to open down, we know that a needs to be negative, right? Remember like 4p kind of the same thing as a? So a needs to be negative. So why is it 